Bullet Talk presents Supercola Afghanistan versus Pakistan ODI Series 2023, powered by Maraba Auctions. Hello and welcome to Humban Tota for the second One Day International. Alongside me, Amir Sohail. Amir, no real surprises after uh, Afghanistan won the toss and decided that they would bat first. Yeah, they had their struggles chasing a total which was set by Pakistanis and uh, this time around. A little bit of swing back into the right-hander. Runs, first boundary of the day, lovely stroke. Uh, let me tell you, this stroke is going to do a world of good. That's pulled away, pulled away and all the way. It seemed like he was waiting for the shortest delivery. And he bounced on it. Stiff he is in his dance. Oh, that is... That is good from Margur Bas. Just using the angle, helping the ball on its way. And he picks up second. Pulled again. Nearly a very similar result, but he was onto this quickly because it wasn't that short. Got a DRS today. That's, that's nice a good shot. Yes, yeah, sorry, that's a that's a great shot. Didn't get high. Get the uh, bat on top of it. That is a good sweep shot. I think there was an element of well, I'm not playing the one with the straight bat too well. Let's think about the sweep shot. A little shorter, that's a good pull shot. Good enough to split the gap between the two men in the deep. Good enough. Sweep has been a favourite stroke. And he picks up a boundary. Now on a surface, when you get the turn, but with that you... Drives, gets a run. Half century for Gurbaz. Will be applauded by his teammates. A brilliant inning, but... Down the track, tremendous stroke, it's gone for six. That is a very strong intent shown from Rahmanullah Gurbaz. So a huge shot by Rahmanullah Gurbaz, a drag down by Usama. And that went a long way, With a massive stroke to a settled batsman like Gurbaz. He's not going to miss out, a brilliant maximum. You will see one or two wickets, we are in the game, that's outside it, deliberately played by Ibrahim Zadran and goes for a boundary. This outfield value for stroke is the maximum. Gotcha. Oh, that's just lofted over mid wicket and way for four. That is some stroke by Zadran. The boundaries are so big, and this is a poor delivery and gets the treatment. Gets the treatment. 10 off 2 deliveries. This is just what Sadran would have wanted. Gotcha! Oh, he's placed this very, very well. Beware the injured man, they say. That is smart batting. That's oh yes, this is a good stroke. Too much work for third man to do. And that'll be 50. Not his most fluent innings, but a very important one nevertheless. That's a thick edge, but it's on its way down to the boundary very, very quickly. Up comes the 150 for Afghanistan. Barely made 50 the other night. They're past the 150 mark now without... That's gone up in the air. It has gone wide of deep square leg. It has gone for four. Yeah, you're right. He has pulled the ball quite well. When as a batsman, you start to... Oh, took the pace off. And the hand comes off the bat. That's always a sign the batsman hasn't spotted it out of the hand. So the adjustment was made. And when you're on 90-odd... Well, he's gone for it this time. He's going to have to hurry yeah. through. The misfield makes it very, very easy indeed. What an innings this has been. They've come back from the brink. They've come back from a horrible defeat two days ago to post 178 without loss for this opening partnership. And Raman Olegobaz. Oh, that's a good shot. That has gone. 
just helped on its way is gone a real distance. Yeah, we've spoken enough about Gurbaz. How about that stroke from Ibrahim? When he came out and... Ex oh, what's he done this time? He's managed to find the boundary, scooped it over the, the man at 45 degrees, but on the edge of the circle. So good awareness of where... Uh, over there. Chipped over mid-wicket. Chipped over wide of long on, had he been there. So successive boundaries and real problems here for Barbara Azam, who's wondering what on earth do I have to do? Well, the short ball is dealt with even more emphatically. That is three boundaries in a row. One innovative, one clever, and this one, well, it's just smacked it. All that's guided away very fine. Four in four. And the deft touch. Power. Great shot. Great drive into the gap for four. This is lovely batting. He's finding new angles and he's middling everything now. Gotcha. There is that slot sweep. Gets it past the man at deep. Shine Shafri. He could only watch it sail across. One bounce over the fence. Bowlers. Gotcha. That's gone and chance at long off finally a wicket falls but not before they've done a huge damage here if if the car takes a catch all pakistani fielders look just a cut shot and that's well placed that really is a great shot shine shafridi not risking a dive highest score for gurbaz in odi cricket and out well there you go Shine Shafridi eventually gets his first wicket of the day but uh, Pakistan with Shine Shah himself with Rizwan Pat well bold and he's given it now was there an inside edge there was a slight suspicion at the time but it was slightly in swinging very straight If he hits, and he does, he is out by a distance. So yes, you might... That one has gone over extra cover. It's the right-hander, not the left-hander, who has played the predicted shot. And he's hit it absolute... Takes a bit of pace off. Nebby gets inside it again. And that is just simply taken. Didn't get it to extra cover. Got it to Imam on the cover boundary, he just took a few steps in. The plan was clear enough, the execution slight. Mm, just within the guidelines. This one sort of tries his best to convince everyone that it's not quite a wide. So that brings to an end this Afghanistan innings. 50 overs complete. Asim Shah looked with Imam al Haq, who was the top scorer for Pakistan the other day but as Ramiz was saying just now either he or maybe Barbara Azam someone at the top of the order needs first ball is allowed to well that's one way of dealing with the challenge for Fakhar Zaman uses his feet well gets the pitch steers it through the gap at extra cover just evades the extra cover there's the width. Now that's the width that allows a batsman to get on the front foot. And it's a, it's a more cross bat shot than a straight bat shot because of that width. That's for sure. Well, that's a heave. That's an ungainly heave, but it's missed the man at short fine leg. Rolls away for four. Not always the best shot. Pull. Away from that fielder. We'll pick up a boundary. You're wasting your breath bowling shot to Imam Ullak. He's been in red hot form. Very, very. That's gone into the gap on the pads, and that's his favorite area. Fakhar Zaman is now looking pretty decent. Off the inside edge, lucky. A streaky boundary for Fakhar. 
Slanting. Oh, yeah, as I was saying, that's the perfect ball to bowl. The in swinging ball finally does it for Faruqi. That's the perfect. Oh, what a way to start the innings. Flowing cover drive. Babar Azam has made that look elegant and ridiculously easy. A toss and clipped away nicely. Oh, just stroke. Now that's cut away for four. This is a good over here for Pakistan. Yeah, once again, Muhammad Nabi giving too much room. Oh, that's a thick edge. It's all along the ground. It's found the gap. Running away down towards the boundary at third for four. Of course, even the thick edges count. That's a nice shot. That's a very, very sweet shot indeed. Someone had to do it. Imam has tried. He's looked as though he's trying to do it, but it's Barbarazm who has used his. Oh, that's why the slip was there. That is so beautifully bold. And here's one of the cruelest ironies of this game of cricket. He's bowled it beautifully. Could have got his man out. Instead, what's happening? It is Barbarazm who's gone to. That's in the air. A slow delivery and taken. This is a big wicket to have of Babar Azam who was looking good. Well that is a bolt from the blue. It really is because down the track. Hesitation run out. Yes. Hedgy. We have started to celebrate already. Mix up big wicket here for Afghanistan to celebrate. Pulls. And that will travel, trickle into the boundary for four. Straight driven. An authentic straight drive for four. Here you go, Hilton. You mentioned that. He's better. Builder there. Oh, he's dropped it. Fazalat Faruqi. Has he dropped the match? And this is not the first time. Oh, this is out. This is out. Nabi has got a wicket. Yeah, against the run of the play. Nabi has come onto ball and he has a agree. Yes! This could be caught. Yes, he's out. Caught on the boundary. Experiment didn't work for Pakistan. Another wicket for Nabi to celebrate. And gone. This is super stuff from Mujib and Afghanistan. Imam ul has been removed from the scene. And Pakistan slumped further. You mentioned about quality. This could be the chance now. When given the chance, if the heart can be lethal. It's a great start to the over. Four through the offside. Help the cause. Shots like this will certainly make it easier. That's a boundary. Welcome boundary for Shadab Khan. So that is the problem. Smack straight. Straight down the ground and that will be four. Sounds good, but it has gone high. And that, that is well taken. Mohammed Nabi had to make a lot of ground to come in from long on. That went high but had no distance. There go those levers, but he hasn't got hold of it. Yeah! The catch is taken. It's Rashid Khan who keeps a cool head at wide mid wicket, and that is exactly what I've got. Full toss, and it's in the gap. It's going to be through for four. So that full toss bisects those two men at a backward square leg and a deep mid wicket. That makes a difference. Oh, another full toss. Oh, that's terrible news for Afghanistan. It's gone for six. The full toss has gone for six. What will be interesting to see? Eleven runs needed. Oh, Faruqi. Oh, Faruqi. Well, this will get tongues wagging all over the world. Do you want to do it this way?
Now that's been hit well, that's been hit very, very firmly. So Pakistan with just this one wicket left with Naseem and Ralph, it's Naseem on strike. He has hit that beautifully. They're still in the game. Yeah, it's off. Oh, it's gone through the gap, it slip. Afghanistan are frustrated almost at the absolute final moment. Pakistan somehow, with just that one wicket left, have found a way to win this game, have found a way to keep their record against.